Hey there everyone and welcome to a game called Stacklands. We're playing this on Steam. Um, I'm not going to leave a Steam link down below but it's like £3.99 on Steam. And we're going to see how this goes. Um, hopefully I've got everything set up correctly but I've watched a couple of YouTubers play this before. You basically start a new thing. We're going to play normal loop moon length on and peaceful mode we off. And basically the whole point of the game, I've played it a little bit as you can see up here. And the whole point of the game is you start with one, a couple of villagers, depending on thing, and you're on this big sort of like mat sort of thing, I guess. Um, so you get your villager to do various different tasks for you. Let me just see if I can turn the music down slightly. And you can speed up time, you can get berries, you need two berries, as you can see up here where my mouse is, to complete the thing. I've got a bunch of different tasks and stuff that I already have done, so you can sell that stuff, you can buy another pack of cards, and you've got to feed your villagers at the end of every single day. Obviously I only have one villager for now, but it does get hectic when you get more and more villagers and then you can start building stuff like this you got ideas to do and I would like to make a spear at some point so you got one wood one stick and one stone Feed my villagers quickly. See, so yeah, I've got it on like speed up time, so everything's going really fast. But you don't have to do that. So I'm going to sell my wood. Get another pack. So I can get another stone. So you need to make a spear. You need one wood and two sticks. So we can turn a piece of wood into a stick. We've got enough berries for him as well. get ourselves a spear going and then we get two sticks and one wood which will turn into a spear and then we can turn this guy into a spear man but what I should have done is made a spear and I can turn him into a thing but I'm actually going to sell that get myself a couple of packs and the packs up um, sort of come from and the packs come from sort of playing the game over long periods of time but I've already unlocked like most of them because I played like, not last night a little bit just to sort of familiarize myself with the game and you can get rats and you have to fight the rats and the old guys can die so you have to be kind of careful of what's going on. So obviously now if he dies hits whips one more hit, two more hits. I'm gonna move him out of the way. You can't move the rats or anything out of the way. You just kind of have to wait and he's going to die because I haven't actually got enough food for him. So when the villagers don't have enough food to turn to a corpse and because I have no other villagers I don't have to start over. So we'll have one more go at this for today's video. Right so we'll do normal length. We won't do any speeding up because that's essentially what ruined me a minute ago. ourselves a berry bush. We'll sell the first berry because that gives us another pack. And then we can grow the next berry within the soil. And as you can see up here in the top left, we've got a bunch of like different berry bush, grow berry bush, and you got ideas of growth 
and uh, gardens. So one soil, two stone. So I can get us a garden going. Let's see if I can. Speed up a little bit here. So you can speed up a little bit. What you really want is to get yourself another villager. Two sticks. So we're going to take our four coins here. We're going to buy a wisdom pack, which gets us another tree. You can obviously pause as well. We get two sticks. One word, two sticks. We'll get ourselves a spear. Get the guy to be a... What's that say? I'm sat kind of far away from the screen. A militia man. Which will then allow us to start the next moon. You can then go on to the rock. Yeah, we got enough berry bushes going, so I haven't really got to worry about that. berry bushes. You can actually grow berries in poop. Which is good. But I want is a never villager so I'm going to start buying that starter pack. Humble Beginnings Pack. In hopes we will get ourselves another. Also, you can have a limit of card numbers you've got here. You've got a limited number of cards that you can have on your map at one time. Now we just about have enough food. I'm going to have two villagers. So we need to get more food, essentially. So now feed him. But we need to get him. So we need two sticks. Days go quite fast in this, but hopefully, oh, an apple tree is good. ourselves another berry bush. We'll get ourselves a campfire. Can't really remember how to do them. One stick, one flint. So we need to start doing some more rocks. I'm not too worried about food now. Oops. 
So we have one flint, one stick, makes ourselves a campfire, and then we can cook that meat on it. Feed ourselves to our villagers. Start our new moon, which we will then start by doing the berry bushes again and hitting a couple of rocks. Get rid of the stone. Keys are important for various different treasure chests, but I normally just sell them because there's no point keeping them around, basically. Right, everybody was fed. Need to get him back in there. Get him back on that. We'll do a couple more moons. We'll get up to moon 12, and then we'll see how we're doing. Let's do a wisdom one. Yeah, a couple more trees, berry bushes. Kinda need to get this guy to so we'll do two sticks, one wood. That will get us a another spear, get him to be a militia man. And now we can look into making ourselves a house. So we'll feed the villagers real quick. We got ourselves a house, which is two wood, one stone, one villager. So we've got one wood there. We got plenty of food. Is that, is that 10? Ourselves another rabbit, berry bush, and raw meat put out on the fire. You can also plant stuff in the poop. Feed the villagers. But what we need now is a house. So to get a house, you need two wood, one stone. So we got a rock here. Two wood, one stone. So what we need to do, we need to get ourselves a tree. Or two wood, one stone, and a villager. And now we'll get ourselves a house. Put an apple tree in the soil. And then we can put both the villagers in there. And they will give us a baby villager. And he will go up. He takes one food per thing. So. He's not as hungry as the rest, and there's a strange portal, which we will deal with that strange portal in the next episode. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause it here and say, I hope you guys did enjoy this video on Sacklands, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. <laughs>